This is Dr. Ansys. Do you know that Workbench Mechanical provides lighting controls on the solid model geometry, mesh, and the results? Well, in this video, I'll show you what options are available for lighting and how they affect the display in the graphics window. First, go to Model Branch. There are four global settings that can be changed. The ambient light value can range from 0 to 1 with a default value of 0 0.1. The ambient light represents the light coming in from all directions. If I change the value from 0 0.1 to 0 0.5, you can see that the shadows become washed out and all parts are brighter as a result of stronger ambient light setting. Now let me change the value back to 0.1. The diffuse light can be thought of as a soft light source originating from the upper right portion of the screen. For example, skylight from a cloudy day may produce diffuse lighting. The value also range from 0 to 1 with the default value of 0 0.6. Let me change the value of diffuse light to 0 and then 0 0.6. Notice how diffuse light cast shows throughout the model with surfaces facing the light source being highlighted. Specular highlight can be thought of as a hard reflection of the light source. It manifests itself in graphics as a bright spot on the object. The range of values is from 0 to 1 with a default value of 1. The color option is defining the color of the light, which is by default white. One can make the light have a different tint of color, such as red. The default setting provides you with a realistic rendering of the geometry since lighting and shadows are present. In some cases, however, you may wish to remove such lighting effects. One such example is when using a contour color map which changes in luminosity, such as a grayscale color map. In such cases, the presence of shadows can make interpreting the contours difficult, as shown here. In this example, the default lighting settings are shown on the left, while on the right, ambient light of 0 0.6, diffuse light of 0 0.1, and a specular highlight of 0 was defined. The results on the right may be easier to view due to the lack of shadows for the contour color map that changes in luminosity. Thank you for watching Dr. Ansys. Please visit www.ansys.com for more information on Ansys simulation capabilities.